It's Monday morning and I'm just vlogging from my bathroom. I figured I'd switch it up a bit since I sit at the bed so much. Uh, I saw the preview pictures on some of the YouTube videos and it's pr pretty much the same spot. So today I have plans just to study Spanish and coding and might stop by the market to pick up some uh, deodorant and maybe get a small umbrella because I found out yesterday uh, it just rains a lot and I don't have anything except a hat and a jacket here so maybe I thought I'd make a little investment in that since I'll be here a little while longer and lunch is coming back today um, I didn't say it yesterday but there's no cooking here on Sunday so uh, <laughs> I had to go out and eat yesterday but uh, food is coming back and uh, it's pretty good other than that, let's see how the day plays out. It's going to be a pretty slow day, though. It's a very beautiful day today. So I basically stayed inside the house today and only stepped outside on the balcony for a breath of fresh air every now and then, but I remained productive and I consolidated all the different areas I wanted to focus on. And I may have mentioned this in another video, but I want to stick to working out Spanish and web development. So I've been doing some research and um, I do, I kind of log my hours uh, on those different areas so I've been doing some research, watching videos, and just to see how to make the best use of my time over the next couple of weeks here. And I do this from time to time as well. So um, I haven't spent a dime today at all. I haven't gone out. I've just been eating the food that my, um, my the owner of the house cooks. She used to be a restaurant cook, so I've been taking advantage of that so I can free up more of my time to invest in other areas and um, food is great and it's varied you know um, I, in the morning I had uh, this kind of like soup with uh, beans or something it was a little bit sweet and you eat it with crackers I'm not sure what the name is exactly uh, for lunch I had some kind of um, uh, I think it was rice and something I, I don't remember it quite exactly and for dinner here we just had chicken and rice and uh, these fried kind of like plantain stuff I should be recording this so you guys can see, but uh, I'll start doing that as well. Um, so haven't spent any money today um, other than the cost of staying here, which is about 7 or $8 a day. Um, spent no money, which is pretty awesome. And I've just been thinking about the past couple weeks here in Medellin um, and why I love it so much. Um, the top three reasons for me are the, is the weather. It's always nice and uh, stable here, about 70, 75 degrees um, almost every day. And with the exception of those uh, rains that come through, um, they only last about two or three hours and they usually go away. And uh, I actually quite like it because it cools the air a little bit and it, uh, just a nice refresher. Uh, second thing about this place that I love is the cost of living. The food, the, the travel, the, the modes of transportation are cheap. Uh, everything just feels right. It just You don't feel like you're spending a fortune on like a 12 or $14 meal like in the States. Here you can get a nice, good, decent meal for uh, 12,000 or 15,000 pesos. So four or five bucks fills you up, tastes good, and it's uh, very interesting as well. And the last reason why I like this place so much is that it just feels like there's a lot of things to do. There, you can go out to a neighborhood somewhere, um, or just go to the park, or if you want to go party. Um, all these things, they don't break the bank. And for example, I went to the park yesterday with Laura. Uh, we went up to Cerro El Balador. It's a nice park with an awesome view. Like I said in other video, I'm definitely coming back there uh, every week just to just to recuperate, just to get away from the city a little bit. And it's really close to 
here. So um, I'm going to be making my daily uh, <laughs> pilgrimage up there, I guess. And other than that, I've been thinking about making maybe a guide to Medellin for newer people that are coming here. A lot of you guys have been watching this and have been asking me various questions. Um, I'll try to string together uh, some of those uh, answers. And also, if you guys want to have any questions, just type them in the comment and I'll see if I can address them here in a video guide that I might make. Um, other than that, I'm just going to kind of uh, um, ch chill out here. I'm just going to watch a couple videos on uh, working out, a couple videos on web development, and just to kick back and meditate and go to sleep. Um, other than that, I hope you guys had a good day. I had a really awesome day, and uh, it might seem slow, but uh, I I like learning. I love learning. So um, that's it for this evening, for today, and I'm going to sign off and catch you guys tomorrow.